Hey guys, Trevor Kuchelina today. We're back with Fruit Basket episode 7. Last episode, we got introduced to two new characters who you all seem to like quite a lot. As from the comments, it seems that they're quite popular characters. I don't know them, so I've, like I said to someone in the comments, um, my thoughts about them, I don't think much of them yet. Um, they had one episode, they were barely in it. I think the, the, the younger girl was in it a bit less. Um, I mean, she was in it for, she came in one episode uh, before that as well. Uh, so I don't think much of them yet. I need a bit more time with them to... It seems like I'm interested... I was interested in the taller, the guy, because he, he's the one who remove, removes memories. So I'm going to be curious to see where, how much he's going to be involved in the series. But I'm even more interested to see why everyone loves him so much. Other than that, uh, you had the friends coming over, giving her the pretty much it. Yeah, you're cool to live there, getting their friends' uh, approval, which was pretty neat, seeing the friends going over as well. Sure as how much to care. And yeah, no, overall, just a nice, wholesome episode. Uh, other than that, guys, I'm looking forward to just get straight into this one. So if you like this content, if you like this video, if you enjoy this video, please like and subscribe, guys. It really does help me out. I'm also doing other seasonal anime along with some live action shows. So I hope to see you with those as well. But let's get into this reaction. Okay, I'm learning more of this episode as well. Looks like they're going to be there. I'm going to guess they're going to be the current arc. A fucking estate, mate. What? Why is the leg so skinny, mate? <laughs> I guess then that woman is dead. Whenever there's a photograph of someone in an anime, they're dead. Or in hospital. Okay, that that makes sense. At least then they won't have any accidents in the hospital when they're getting torched. They must have a lot of support for them. Dissect his opinion. <laughs> Savage. <laughs> Ooh, the look of sadness. What happened? <laughs> Just drop that bomb and <laughs> walk off. <laughs> what a guy. Well, that escalated quickly. Guys, give you perspective of what how this story could turn out, but I doubt it will do. Maybe it doesn't art wish gets memory erased. <laughs> I love this guy; he's just the most chill dude ever. <laughs> what way his past is? I'm quite interested to know more about the dog guy. I like him quite a lot. I mean, I love his voice like that. So deep. What do you got? I love to have a voice like that. It's so cool. Triggered. Well, you know them. There's everything by himself. You yeah, definitely are. Tackle it to the floor. Yes, we get to see his animal. What is he? I should really try and guess what they are. Well, that's not what I expected at all. A seahorse. Oh, 
oh, we're going to get flashbacks. This, this is what I prefer. It's all cool for a character to explain what happens when you actually see the characters interact in flashbacks. Always a lot more interesting. Oh, smooth. Oh, the music. Oh, nailed that song there. Oh. I love how he's basically what Kyo is and uh, Rat Boy is at the moment in their situation with Toro. Oh, rejected. Ooh, how dead would you feel? Oh, I'm glad to give the flashback. It's way more interesting when they do that. I thought they were just going to leave it out of the character explanation of it. What the? Hey, we got the kiss. That means we can kiss without turning into animals. So that's a good sign for later. And spring came. How long were we together for them before we had to grab that memory? So that could work. That was only two months. Oh, is this is savage. We'll see every now and again. Which is just crazy or something. Look now, why is she going berserk? Why is she going berserk? I don't understand. I wonder why she's letting Toru stay. Toru stay then. What's her motive? <sighs> oh, like that shot, that was dramatic. So you need to know more of the context of why the mom, I'm guessing the person who's in charge said no. I wish I said they was there together a bit longer as well, like two months is a bit short. Especially when getting married. Should have would be nice if it was like a year, a couple of years or something, that would have been tragic as hell. Oh shit. Mate. What are the odds? Alright, so he took away the memory up to when the first met. Yeah, good for him to feel happy for. Wouldn't everyone else remember them being together though? Oh, well, because it was only two months, they wouldn't have noticed. Oh, 
<laughs> I wish you did that, did the sound effect. And I'm here like, I'm on winter back already. Good way to introduce us to a character. I love this guy, he's just a dude, mate. Such a bro. The curse is interbreeding, my love. There's not many of us. Oh, that sinister music. At least we're learning along with Toru, which is nice. Toru, so. I want to know more about that person. Episode 7 finished, guys. Um, I think it was a nice introduction to that male. To Harry, I think his name. I think his name's Hattery, but they do anyway with her past. Good introduction to his character. Um, I'm glad they didn't just leave it at the foreign kid explaining it. I'm glad they actually showed us some of it. Yeah, it's a bit sad past for him. Um, explains why they go on about the curse a bit more, and obviously they forget um, how bad memory wiping can be. Especially when the guy had to do it. Like, a good lesson for him as well. Like, he's had to do it to other people. And, like, when it's finally someone who he knew and it affected him. Like, Deepa goes, I'm interested to see more about this head chick, see what a problem is. Because um, it seems to be a bit more to it. And guy's happy. He seems like he's just got a cool, cool vibe about him. And I'm glad he's actually happy for the girls moved on. Um, yeah, they're pretty sad past overall. Um, Sombre episode. The music was on point with this episode, definitely. And then, yeah, Toru's just being a normal self, which is pretty cool. And obviously, you know, that nice little parallel between him and his her, Ataru and his missus. But other than that, uh, not too much more to say. I'd say, like, I'm curious to, to learn more, a bit more about some of the other members of the family now, and we can get some cool little side stories there, as it can nail them. Like I said, the only complaint is two months isn't a lot, a lot of time to be together with someone. I'm on that's just from a personal perspective for me it takes a long time I would say it takes more than a couple months to actually fall in love with someone uh, maybe a year a year but that's just me personally but I can lose someone still especially when you haven't been with someone before and that's your first interaction with be especially being someone like him who's put, put in like a dark place in his world and then someone finally comes through and breaks him out of it and then losing that I can see understand that being such a big deal but for me personally um, it would be nice if it was like a couple of years though together before they was pulled away from each other. But it would have made sense as well for like everyone would have known they'd been together, so we would have had to wipe out quite a lot of memories. So that makes sense, I guess. But they're pretty sad overall to lose someone like that. Like I said, pulling someone, pulling you from such a low state. But it's obviously changed his character for the good forever. But other than that, guys, I hope you enjoyed my reaction. Hope to see you next week. Peace. <laughs>